All right, welcome back. Let's go back to radar one more time. I want to show you where the rain is right now, mainly across Wilson County. We're not seeing a lot here in San Antonio, but some pop ups and now a lightning strike just showing up for the first time here, and that's just north of Floresville in between 181 and Highway 97 there. This is going to work its way towards Stockdale or maybe just north of Stockdale, but that's kind of the first lightning strike we've seen pop up on our radar. We're likely going to see more as we get into the afternoon. We got to be prepared for some scattered storms today, some of which could be strong. So that area you see in pink, that's where the Storm Prediction Center has kind of outlined the risk for severe weather, and it, it basically is our entire viewing area. And this is going to go through tonight. The main risk is going to be hail if we see some severe storms, something we'll certainly keep you posted about if anything severe does pop up. 40% chance of rain tonight clears out though some tomorrow drier air by Friday afternoon. First half Saturday looks good. Another chance of storm Saturday night and a good chance of rain coming up on Sunday. So a lot to look at there in the seven day forecast. Keep that KSAT weather app handy today, guys. Thank you, Justin. And SA Life has some refreshing drinks, some delicious foods. And a guy who can wield a knife. <laughs> See the way he cut that avocado? Oh, perfect. Ah, that's pretty good. Did he cut himself? Where'd go, <laughs> Mike? SA Life starts right now. Celebrate San Antonio. Coming to you live from Historic Market Square. This is SA Live. Oh, hello and happy Thursday. Viva Fiesta. Good afternoon, everybody. Woohoo! Oh my. Yes, I'm Fiona Gorris Duza. And I'm Mike Oster Hage. Oh, the excitement is building here because we're getting some of the, the, yeah. the things all set up and some of the food <laughs> booths here at Market Square. And of course, you know, starting really tomorrow and then next week, it is just going to be a million people down here. And of course, the official kickoff is tonight with Fiesta Fiesta. Mm -hmm. And we once again have the privilege of hosting on stage tonight. And come on out there. We look forward to seeing you all. Yes, uh, 301 East Travis Street. And if you can't make it down to see us, don't worry, because you can watch it all on KSAT 12 from 8 to 10 p.m. Yep. All right. We're going to be down there about, what, 5 o'clock or 4.30, something, something like that? Something like that. Uh, you got your disco naps in, right? <laughs> Four of them, I think, and counting. Our first guest today, though, has a fiesta event the whole family won't want to nap through. Trust me, because Alamo Heights Night is tomorrow night. Yeah, one of the big, big first family events there. And Mike Moody with Games 2, uh, you is here, and he's got all of the fun, like the game behind us. So good to see you, sir. Good to see you guys again. So how many years? now you've been doing Alamo Heights night with all oh, these games. 13 now? Since they moved to Incarnate Ward, we've been on the football field. Okay. Wow. So how many different games do you have there tomorrow night? About a half dozen or so. We like to fill up the football field with some variety. We've got a bounce house for some kids. We've got the teenager rock wall. We have a triple obstacle course and slide. Yeah. We've got a little carnival ski ball here oh. that I see that Mike's trying to play with unsuccessfully. No. We'll have this, we'll have a basketball dual shootout, so a little bit of everything. We have a gaming theater there as well, so it's a little bit for everyone. So we have an ongoing competition right here with Fiona and I, uh, because in, in years past, I know she's kind of had trouble sort of beating me at some of these games, right Fiona? Have I? In years past? Is this, ah, a, ah, really? is this a dexterity problem it. we have here? No? I got it. There we go. So you got it. It's the honor can, system, right? That was 100. Did you can roll. See okay, I got you. I got you. You can roll or you can toss. There's no rules. There's no. 100. There's another almost do I, 100. Do I get more credit if I get 200s? Uh, oh, Mike, that was a zero. Or is the trick trying to... to uh, Fiona's ah. almost, Fiona's going for the hundreds. Go for the bigger hole is 25. There you go. Ski ball is always fun. Oh. Not so easy. Yeah, Mike, why is ski ball such a fun game? <laughs> oh. Mike, that was, you just aired that under right yeah, there. Nothing but net on that, that one. That was nothing but net. And this is just a sampling yes. of what you guys have. Because yes. you have we, something for every season. We do. We'll right? have a little bit. We're there 5.30 to 11.30 as, as usual. So okay. six hours of complete, total fun. On the football field, not not hard to find us. Just come to the football field and start enjoying yourself. All right, and don't forget, uh, free admission for children under 12, active and reserve military with a valid ID. Now, Alamo Heights Night, obviously, as most Fiesta events, benefits a very good cause, right? Yes, it is. The Rotary Club Alamo Heights, it's it's a fundraiser, and they always do a great job for their, the, 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 the nonprofits they support and well run, and we just love to support it. All right, and of course, uh, 
how can folks book you for an event or, to, or a party? Oh, for us, events. Games2u.com always gets us, or if you're lazy, g2u.com gets us. There's some B-roll. There's, there's Alamo Heights uh, night. That's the, actually a football field full of fun. That is from that's, a previous year. That's, wow. So that's a little bit of what it's going to look like, that right? Is, it's, there's a drone shot overhead from like three years ago. That's kind of what it'll look like on Friday night. So if folks want tickets, you can you you uh, you can get a wristband for unlimited free play to do the field, or I believe uh, you can also do tickets. Uh, do it ride by ride. It's your choice. Now, if you have at your big event, your your church group, your um, you know corporate event. If you've got something the size of a football field, you can fill it, right? Oh, absolutely. That, as you saw <laughs> from the drone footage, we can. Small or large, we really, we don't have a set package. It's all a la carte. So we really want to meet the needs of what you're trying to do for your guests and patrons. So any type of event, we, we have a variety, wide variety of stuff. What are some of the most competitive, uh, you know, kind of ones that you have? The well, we've done. ball look pretty competitive. Anyway, yeah. <laughs> our rock wall that's going to be out on Friday night has a timed course on it digital timer up there. You oh, push really? a button on the bottom, it starts the clock, you push a button on the top, kids will go at it and do time, low time of the day, adults will go at it and try to see you can do the low time. So it's not just style points on the rock wall, it's how quick you can get up and down it. And I remember the one time, because I think we did most all of those things, there's the... Uh, oh. Oh, the, the hamster, hamster ball. The hamster ball. Yes. Yes. Okay, that's Catholic. Not, yes, and we then did. one of those giant obstacle course things. Yes. That's we, tough to do. That's we a have, common Mount Everest. You guys did the dual obstacle course where you went side by side. We're bringing out the triple, which is side by side by side. It's a bigger version of the dual one that you've experienced. Where you can actually have three people go in, three people come out, and it's a race. Up, down, around. Through. And then eventually only one comes out ever. No, <laughs> yeah. I'm just kidding. I'm the, just kidding. The two other <laughs> disappear, right. No, <laughs> the two no. disappear. But what's great is, I mean, you could bring this to a neighborhood block party, to sure. the street, to a cul-de-sac, Sh forever. Schools and churches are big are big clients of ours. We're, in a, we're approved vendor of all the school districts here in San Antonio and Austin, New Braunfels. So we're a known entity. We provide safe, you know, background checked, great, great fun for them, and we're, we're doing it every day of the week. About how many different games, oh, blow up things you have? You know, Warehouse of Fun, you mean? Yeah. Uh, where is, uh, if you were to do a skew, I bet we have about 40, 45 skews uh, yeah. of things in our Warehouse of Fun that we can, we can mix and match and just really customize however you want. What's your favorite? I like the rock wall. The rock wall is fun because you know we're known for our video game theaters. Yeah. But uh, video gaming gets a bad rap sometimes because you're lazy and you don't get out and whatever. We've got plenty of stuff to get your blood pumping. I'm telling you. So if you want to get out and have fun. Still a mind workout though. Yeah, yeah it's a mind workout. Game, yeah. All right. <laughs> Once again, Alamo Heights night is tomorrow from 5:30 to 11:30 at the University of Incarnate Word. For more information on Alamo Heights night and games to you, head to salive.com and click on the As Seen on SA Live tab where we've provided a link. And don't forget, if you're partying at home this year, we have all of the parade coverage for you. You can watch the Cavaliers River Parade. You can watch the Battle of Flowers, the Flambeau Parades right here on KSAT 12. The Pooch Parade and King William Fair Parade will stream on KSAT.com and KSAT Plus. And all of the events, of course, get going tonight. And we are going to be talking about uh, Fiesta Fiesta, which is coming up shortly. Now, a lot of Fiesta events include maybe some uh, libations here. And so we have a question for you yes. as our assistants come in here. <laughs> you can only pick one. You can only pick one. Which is better, the margarita, the michelada, or the mangonada? You can only pick one. Are you just gonna sip? You're gonna you're gonna sip both of the ones you're holding. Yeah, thank. I'm gonna go with the mango nada. That's pretty good. I'm gonna go with the margarita. I, I thought you would. All right, Jen, what would you pick? Like you can only that. pick one. <laughs> no, all three for me, guys. <laughs> I like smart. her style. Margarita, yes, all three every time. Yeah, <laughs> That's let my us girl. Know. <laughs> at our Facebook page, yes, at SA Live Kisa, uh, SA Live Kisa on our Facebook or Twitter page, and we'll share your answers, guys. Sorry, I have to go with all three. I don't think you figured out where I am yet, so I gave you the hint. They love Military City USA. The big reveal now. We are at AFFCU. Yes, the one on Braun. And 1604, it's one of three branch locations they have around town. We're here and we're going to start giving away medals at 2 p.m. Now, there is a limited amount, 
So keep that in mind. The line has already started building. And hurry up and get in your spot in line. And here with us right now is Jared Levine, Financial Center Growth and Experience Manager. Hello. Which one would you pick? Oh, if I had three? to pick one. I have <laughs> put me on the spot. I have to go with the margarita. I've always been the sucker for a lime margarita. The ones at the Ooh. Spurs Center, the AT&T Center. Okay. I love it. That's the one for me, guys. I like what you asked me earlier. You were like, are you bringing a margarita I know. Machine? What are we doing? Okay, no. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not. <laughs> I got an HR here. I can do that. <laughs> <laughs> but it's a very understandable question because I asked you that. Okay, so we're here, and you're going to give us a little tour, right? So tell, yes. well, tell us about what, uh, where we're at here in your center. So you are at AFFC, your Brown location, Air Force Federal Credit Union. So what you have here is obviously one of our financial centers, one of our newest financial centers that we have on the map. Uh, we are one of the award-winning financial centers. And of course, you take a tour there, you have Miss Sally Celestina, she's out there helping out a member today. <laughs> and then you have Mr. Eddie back there, our security guy. He's always uh, he's out there protecting the Fiesta medals to make sure no one's stealing yes, them. And yes. then of course we do have um, our cardboard cutout kids. We do support the Methodists, you know, bringing awareness to the abused children. You know, obviously that's always you know AFSU really cares about the people in the community, and we always just want to stay involved and bring awareness to anything that we can and just get involved in any way that we can. Got it. Well, I love hearing that. Yes, and speaking of getting involved with the community, you have the line already building I out know, there. Excited. And when they come here, they will also get something, right? Yes, yeah, so they will be getting, it's going to be a little, a little swag bag here that does have our Fiesta medal in there. It has a couple of swag items that they could take. And of course, a business card for me that they can call me. They can always come into the branch and we'll take care of them. It does have a URL code, or URL code that they can go to our website, goffcu.com. All right, so again, you can get that, and we are also going to give away some prizes, some raffle prizes from KSAT and SA Live. So again, today's medal giveaway is at AFFCU Loop 1604, and Bron, can you, can you, and uh, it starts at 2 p.m. Back to you guys. Jen, you know how you said all three? Watch what I just discovered. We have these tables with wheels. You go like this, take a sip here. We turn it, we go like this, take a sip here, and then we turn it. And Fiona and I are going to do this all hour long, so we'll finish them up for you, though. Thank you very much, Jen. So, wow. you like, the, you like this idea? Fun. Pretty yeah. creative, huh? Yeah, you're going to get funnier. <laughs> <laughs> Where are we? <laughs> We're at the end, right yeah, here. Yeah, this is you. Still to come. See? There. Go on, read. <laughs> SA Live continues with a taste of Fiesta Fiesta. We have one of today's vendors joining us, and you won't believe, oh, the Spread This Local Cafe brought. See, you're already funnier. All right, get ready to ride through Fiesta in style. Toyota is celebrating 15 years as the official vehicle of Fiesta, and we take a look at their lineup. That's next on SA Live. Tonight is Fiesta Fiesta powered by Toyota Texas. It's the exclusive home of the all new Tundra and all new all hybrid Sequoia SUV. And they're celebrating a big anniversary too. We're at the Toyota Texas plant on San Antonio South Side with Suzanne Kazunas, Vice President of Manufacturing. Hello, hello. Hello Fiona, we are so happy to have you here. And you guys, of course, congratulations on your anniversary. Tell us about exactly what you're celebrating. We are celebrating 20 years since we broke ground here on the South Side to build the amazing Toyota Tundra. This year also significant because your team for the first time is producing an SUV and it is the official vehicle of Fiesta. It is the official vehicle of Fiesta. Fiesta, the Toyota Sequoia body on frame, full size SUV, all hybrid. We are so excited. And so in addition to the 3 million trucks we've made since we started production here nearly 20 years ago, now we're adding this amazing SUV. And how many people does it take to assemble a Toyota Sequoia? We have on our campus nearly 10,000 people. So in addition to our main manufacturing plan here at Toyota Motor Manufacturing Texas, we have 23 on-site suppliers, and they have folks that do everything from build, who make parts, who are a piece of this production, and then there's folks that do all sorts of other things like maintenance, accounting, you name it, we've got the career here. And speaking of careers and those other jobs, joining us right now is Miss Fiesta, Jaslyn Ramirez. Viva Fiesta! Thank you, Fiona, we're glad to have you here. So why don't I show you 
what we have going on in the back. All right. We are in the heart of the Texas Toyota plant. Where are we? Yes, we are here where the vehicles come off the line for the very first time every 60 seconds. Every 60 seconds. That yes. is incredibly cool. Yes. And tell us what you do here at Toyota Texas. So here at Toyota Texas, I work for a supply company called Forma LLC, which they are in charge of the truck beds of the new Tundras. And how does it make you feel when you see a Tundra or a Sequoia on the road? When I see a Tundra or Sequoia on the road, I think of how they are native to Texas just as I am. And what does it mean to you to know that you represent your company, Forma, and Toyota Texas? Being able to represent Forma is such a privilege because first they are minority and women owned, and being able to represent Toyota Texas is an honor because they are actually one of Fiesta's largest sponsors. Yes, you can learn more about careers at Toyota Texas online for Toyota professional positions. Visit toyota.com slash careers. And for Toyota production line positions, visit toyotatracktexas.com. Still ahead on SA Live, I'm going to dive into some of this delicious food that you can find down at Travis Park tonight for Fiesta Fiesta, this shrimp cocktail in a bowl and these delicious pastries. A lot of food vendors down there tonight. Fiona and I are going to be down there as well. Yes, and find mm. your dream home this spring. Whatever home design you can imagine, our next guest probably has it ready and waiting for you to tour. Welcome back to SA Live. Well, brand new custom homes in the Hill Country and right here in San Antonio. Yes, we're coming up on the last weekend of the Spring Tour of Homes. And here with everything you need to know is Christy Sutterfield with the Greater San Antonio Builders Association and Isaac Gonzalez, Hello. new home consultant with Chesmer Homes. Welcome, welcome to both of you. Hello, thank you, thank you. All right, Christy, tell <laughs> us about the tour and your sponsors. I mean, folks can expect a lot, right? They sure can. We have 60 houses on the tour this year, and we've got six key communities all over 23 counties. It's amazing, and everyone needs to come out and see the new warm colors in the houses. Um, outdoor living is hot. Kitchens are hot. Sweeping foyers. There's something for everybody. Home prices start right at that 300,000 mark and go all the way up to a million. And we couldn't have this scattered site open house without CPS energy. <laughs> oh my goodness. And Isaac, what makes Chesmar Homes different from the other builders? Yes, at the end of the day, it's going to be our amazing culture. So when a member of our family comes through the doors, we promise to treat them as if they're our own personal family. So we want to give them an all tens experience all the way through, even after home ownership. Okay, and you have communities all over the city, right? We sure do. We've got communities ranging from the Castroville area to the Cibolo area, all the way towards Bernie. And we even have a community right near the medical center here in San Antonio. I'm looking at some of these images and people can actually du duplicate the exact look and feel of your model homes. That's exactly right. And I, I'm really excited to share that with family members because when someone comes through our doors, they're able to replicate the look and the feel for the model homes for just about the base price of the home. So what, what that basically cool. means is someone can come in and they don't have to worry about the model homes being $100,000 above the base price. Right. It's very realistic. If they like it the way it is, that's pretty much that's where right. it's going to be. And their design centers are in their model home, so they get to see their selections right there. 100%. So when a family comes in, they don't have to go to an off-site design yeah. center, come from the model home, they're able to look and feel, play with things, move things around. Exactly, and it's fresh in their mind, because usually when you have to you know, wait a week or you know something to go somewhere else, you're kind of like, Did <laughs> I think that'll work, right? Exactly right? But it's all right there. So let's talk about some of the features that really make things stand out for folks. So a lot of the times it's going to be the natural light, the architecture of our homes. Uh, one of the things is we've got floor to ceiling windows in a lot of our floor plans or the unique design where you have a balcony out of the living room area. So a lot of families will be able to have the really ability to make changes as well. Okay, 
And Christy, what about you? What do you like when you see? Oh, Fiona, it's the kitchens. <laughs> I love to cook, and some of these kitchens are magnificent. But you know what? I've toured a lot of these houses. Uh -huh. The kitchens go into the living area, into the outdoor space. It's magnificent. So. You can have all your family, you know, if the kids are doing homework, uh -huh. they can be right there while mom's cooking. And then the islands, the islands are second to none. So it's all about the fluidity, right? Yes, Yes, all right, okay. And then of course, the Spring Tour of Homes app. Oh, goodness, y'all, the Spring Tour app, it is so cool. It is powered by Security Service Federal Credit Union. You can go to any home on the tour. It'll take you to the link to like Chessmar Homes. It'll take you to that builder's website. It will give you driving directions. It'll even let you calculate what your monthly payment would be. Love it! Tour of the homes on the Spring Tour of Homes this Saturday and Sunday in San Antonio, New Braunfels, and Bernie. For more, SABuilders.com. You can also download the free mobile app for iPhone and Android. Just search SA Spring Tour of Homes. Christy and Isaac, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So ahead on SA Live, the line's growing. You still have time. Metal giveaways start at 2 o'clock. Say hi, everybody. All right. And look, they're giving away pan dulce and some raffle giveaways. Go ahead, Patty. Okay, I'll take one of those. Take it up, don't okay. About to give away number, something right now. Three, three, three. Three, three, three. three. All right. The fun continues. Stay with us. And we get a taste of Fiesta Fiesta. Wait a second. I knew it. I knew it. Mike is already tasting it. It's veritable smorgasbord of Fiesta flavors. Don't miss this local vendor next. And don't forget, you can watch, do the part, watch party, the Battle of Flowers Parade with your favorite KSAT personalities. Tickets are on sale now and there's only a limited amount. To get yours, just scan the QR code on your screen or go to KSAT.com. Stay with us, more SA Live is on the way. Welcome back to SA Live. We are looking at one of the delectable dishes from one of the newest cafes downtown, right across from Travis Park and Fiesta Fiesta tonight. If you have not eaten there yet, you don't know what you're missing. Joining us is the owner of Flourish Goods, Chef Su Yin Wong, and they are one of the food vendors. That's right, at Fiesta Fiesta today, tonight, you know. Welcome, welcome, welcome. <laughs> Thank you so much for uh, having me. All right, what did you bring today? Because he's already got it getting it started. So today we're going to make a Fiesta shrimp cocktail. Okay. I have laid the ingredients right here specific for you. So you are just dividing the main dish that has all already been curated and cooked. Mm -hmm. And this is nice as far as a shrimp cocktail, because usually you think of shrimp cocktails, there's about five or, bit, or six. You oh, know, yes. no, we are going Dip to it be. And eat it. Yeah. Now there's a whole bowl full. Okay. So we're going to be generous. So Yay. these ingredients go in there. This is ketchup. All of it? All of it. All of it. Okay. okay. A little bit of ketchup in there. Okay. And then there is this buffalo sriracha sauce. So this kind of takes the place, as we were talking about, of uh, horseradish, which would be in the usual kind of uh, cocktail sauce that you Correct. You think and with. then the next step is cilantro, but with the cilantro, you just put as you wish. I just put a little bit in there. Not a huge cilantro fan, but I'm going to okay. not break up your cucumber, recipe. Cucumber, one cup of cucumber. One okay. whole cup, all right. Nice mm -hmm. and fresh mm -hmm. and light. And that's the thing with a lot of your dishes here. You've got now snacks in the afternoon that it's not yes. a big heavy meal, but just you need that little something to kind of tide you over, right? Yes, we introduce snacks now as second shift. In the morning, we have brunch, the mm -hmm. basic baked goods. And now we are putting shrimp cocktail. We are putting raspas that... Um, very San Antonian um, uh, snack menu. And then I put a little bit of pico in there? On the pico, you can be generous as well. Okay, so I can just kind of... I usually put one cup. Okay. And that is about maybe a quarter of that bowl. Oh, wow. Okay, there we go. Okay. Same here. Okay, about a quarter of this bowl. That's and looking beautiful. Thank you very much. All those colors. And then we're going to put it into this bowl right here. After you mix it, we are missing one step, Mike. Oh, wait, 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 Mike. Correct. Do the, the we have a orange soda. Oh, uh -huh. That's a secret. And then, not so much secret. And then we have a sparkling margarita. It goes into the so mix. Pour this. 
Everything, All the it? whole two ounces. Okay. Oh, Sparkling so margarita next. So yes. Just adds that little bit of something yes. to it. Mix in the bowl. That That's secret right. ingredient. Now, not only do you have dishes like this, but also your baked goods, which are fantastic. Yes, our legendary biscuits are still there. Brownies, cupcakes, scones. And you've got People breakfast sandwiches too. We have breakfast sandwiches. We also have uh, the Monte Cristo panini. That that is a favorite of everybody. And the chips are extra special on top of that, right? Those chips are very particular. It is a corn tortilla made with cactus, black seed, and chia seed. So, more healthy. Ooh, look at that. Fiona, that looks beautiful. And Good I do job, a little, black oops, sorry. sorry. You, want, you want some avocado? Yes, please. How did I do on my uh, garnishing? There you go. There you go. There you go. Uh -huh. This Perfect. is awesome. Look. Da -da -da. If you need help, okay. uh, some light. you can add some chips over here. Mm -hmm. Now, and of you course, will have some deals and specials, right? For military? Yes, military, senior citizens, mm -hmm. and downtown employees for sure. Okay. All right, and let's take a walk through what's over here. Over here, we have some brownies, we make cupcakes. Um, Almost every day, we also do the biscuits. The biscuits have our signature heart in the middle. We can do it sweet, we can do it salty as well. And what do you got, think of the flavor? Oh, this is fantastic. And I love, and I love that it's a bowl full of shrimp cocktail. Uh -huh. <laughs> you can pair it with mineral water, you can pair it with a beer, you can pair it with whatever fresh Okay, drink back you to want. our social question then. Mm. What would go best with this? A margarita, a mango nata, or a michelada? A mango margarita michelada. There we go. More than likely. Oh Just God. like Jen. Also, Just like Jen. Mm -hmm. Your version of the um, the sandwich, the, uh, why can't I think of it right now? Monte Cristo. Thank Monte you. Cristo. Which yeah. is delicious. It's still Thank amazing. you so much. Thank right. you so much. So we'll VIP see you for area Fiesta. tonight, right? That's correct. Okay. See you there. All right. For more information on Flourish Goods, all you have to do is head to our website, salive.com. Click on the As Seen on SA Live tab where we provided the link or just scan that QR code on your screen. Next on SA Live, the line's continuing to grow here at AFFCU Off 1604. And Bron will tell you what you need to know if you want to snag a medal. Stay with us. Ah, beautiful Market Square on this first day of Fiesta, and boy, there's going to be just a million people out here over the next few days, and everybody's sporting all their metal sashes, and Jen Tobias Trusky's out with our latest secret metal giveaway. Yes, she's out at AFFCU at Loop 1604 and Braun Road, and they're going to start giving out medals at 2 PM. But make sure you have your spot in line because there is a limited amount, right, Jen? That's correct, Fiona. You said it best because we don't want you to get here and then there's none left. So try to get here quickly. What, 20 minutes away before we start giving them away here at AFFCU? I have Jared Levine, Financial Center Growth and Experience Manager with AFFCU, joining me again. Okay, so let's talk about what AFFCU stands for? Yeah, so AFFCU stands for Air Force Federal Credit Union. We've been proudly serving the military and their families for over 70 years. But what a lot of people don't know is that we are here for the community. Everyone who lives and resides in San Antonio, Texas, you are eligible for membership. We offer great rates, premier member service. Come on in. You can always visit us at goffcu.com. Also, you could get our award-winning mobile app, top rated, get you where you need to be. Got it. And how excited are you? How excited are you guys? Yeah. To be hosting, I, I to know. be hosting this. It is such an honor, such a privilege. I'm so excited to be kicking off a uh, fiesta like this. They told me that my branch was going to be in the shot, and I just, I was ready for it. I was here yes. for it. Loved oh, it. Oh, like, what's your favorite thing about fiesta? <sighs> can I say it on TV? I mean, <laughs> yes, you I can. I love it. I love uh, Nyosa. Nyosa's Nyosa, my thing. Yes. I love it. That's the yes. one that I'm going to go to. 
that's the one that I got to be at. That one's a good one. Yes, and AFFCU is running some high rate deposit specials. So let's talk about that. Got to yes. get that in there too. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> so we are offering one of our newest products is actually the high yield savings accounts at 3% for the initial $25,000 that you deposit. It's one of our hottest products. Members love it. We are offering some Viva Fiesta promotions right now. So you have a 5.25 on the 18 month certificate jumbo. And we are offering a 5% on a 12 month certificate. So those rates won't last long. So you got to come in or go online and we'll take care of you. Got it. And there's a few locations right around town. Yeah, there sure is. So we have the lovely brown location with all these beautiful people out here. And then we have, <laughs> and then we have two in the Valley High area. And yes, then we are it, opening it. one. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. A little late. We're good though. We're good. We're good. Uh, what type of location? And then we have a two outside the Valley High location. Uh -huh. uh, and then uh, we also have one in the Stone Oak area should be opening up really soon. All right, now we're gonna do a giveaway and then we'll put you more information on the screen, yes. but let's go ahead and give a raffle giveaway. Yeah. Ra raffle giveaway, okay. Okay, thank you, Patty. Okay, ready, you want me to yell in this? Okay, here's the winner, 295. 295. The last three digits, 295. 295. Anybody the winner? Anybody? Oh, winner. Okay, we'll do one more. Don't worry, we got a winner over there. Okay, one more winner. Okay, one more. Number 361. 361. Who's the winner? 361. 361. Where's 361? Okay, let's try one more. One more. One more. One more. Okay, ready? 353. 353. There's got to be a 353. All right. Yay. For more information on AFFCU, give them a call at 210-673-5610 or visit their website, goaffcu.com. Again, today's medal giveaway is at AFFCU at Loop 1604 and Braun Road. Come and get in line, get your medal, and we'll start handing them out. We're just counting down the minutes now. Love seeing all the folks out there, Jen. Tell them we said hi. Yes, and Viva Fiesta. Oh, Mike, Mike and Fiona say hi. <laughs> hi. They said hi back, guys. <laughs> oh, well, how you can help clean up San Antonio's river and make our city a beautiful place to live. The San Antonio River Authority joins us with a little advice for this fiesta. Don't let litter trash your river. Important words to remember this fiesta season as all those chicken on the stick and fruit cups and manganadas generate a whole bunch of trash. Make sure they make it into a trash can and not in the San Antonio River. And we are here at Padre Park learning more about the San Antonio River Authority's Trash Initiative with Katie Broad, who is the Public Affairs Manager. Yes. Good to see you. Oh, it's always so pretty down here. Love it. I know. Okay, so tell us all about this whole trash initiative. We don't like trash ending up in the river for many reasons. One, you, you have this beautiful landscape. You don't want to see that, right? We have right now, there's little baby ducks over here. We don't want them to eat the trash. Um, we don't want it to ruin the ecology here. It's a big problem. It is something that the River Authority wants to help solve. And so we're just trying to raise awareness on how trash can cause issues and what you could do to solve it. How can you become a river warrior? Well, we have a wonderful volunteer program where you can sign up, you can um, go out on kayaks and help pick up the trash. You could take trainings and learn all sorts of stuff about invasive species, all sorts of things. But really, you could be a river warrior every day by taking your trash and disposing of it properly. Which, yes, we, we all learn, but now with Fiesta coming up, and I think about, okay, Fiesta's in the city, it's not even hardly near the river, except for the river parade. Yes. Does that trash, I mean, what's that up to Very do? good point, yes. Uh, things that people need to understand is that wherever you are, you're in a watershed. So whenever it rains, that's gonna take that trash immediately to the river or a creek of some sort, and it's gonna make its way here. And then it's gonna collect, and the city and the River Authority, they spend a lot of time picking up trash, especially after Fiesta. Okay, nobody likes to see trash, I mean, whether it's on the ground or in the river, but it makes a bigger impact if it gets into the river, right? It does, yes, it can, uh, you know, animals can think it's food or it can choke them, it could get stuck on them. Um, you know, turtles, they can, you know, we all know the straw right. issue, debacles. There's just so many reasons why it's bad. And um, you can always go to our website at theriverauthority.org to learn more. 
and how you could do your part to oh. um, help be a part of that solution. And there's a big Fiesta event down here on the river. Yes, up, right? yes. The San Antonio River Foundation and the River Authority are working together to put on the official kayaking Fiesta event. So it's our flotilla. It's going to be here. Um, we are out of kayak rentals, but you could bring your own kayak and come out and have fun. We're going to have food, vendors, music. It's going to be a great time. And get ready to pick up a bunch of trash. Yes, please, please. Any little thing <laughs> helps. So once again, the Mission Reach Flotilla Fiesta is happening Saturday the 22nd right here at Padre Park from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Again, no more kayaks are available, but you can still bring your own. Visit SARIVERFOUNDATION.ORG for more information. And remember, don't let litter trash your river. Let's give the river a helping hand this fiesta and every day. For more information on the Trash in Initiative, visit the website right there on your screen. Katie, thank you very much. Thank you so much. Hey, tomorrow on SA Live, Fiesta doesn't really get going until you've got the right attire for it. We check out Fiesta headbands, flower crowns, and a whole lot more from a local designer. Plus, dinner made easy, we share some taco night recipes sure to please the entire family with just a few ingredients. It's all tomorrow at 1, right here on SA Live. It would be kind of the trifecta uh, of Fiesta beverages. It sure would. And now we're making people choose. What's better, a margarita, a michelada, or a mango nada? Let it roll! Mango margaritas from Elizabeth. You know, I got to agree with you there, Liz. Margarita, especially the ones made with fresh fruit. There I you go, like Kim. Kim. Yep. Mm -hmm. And from Linda, a margarita made from fresh limes. Margarita time. A mango, oh, manganadas, Priscilla in all capital letters. She is serious about that one. And Gina says, mango nada. I've seen a lot of mango nadas. Oh, mango nada, margarita all day long from Lori. And I prefer pina colada. Okay, nobody voted for the uh, right, michelada. Right, right, right. You know, I think because the beer kind of gets in the, the hot, humid mm. weather a little heavier, so the, these are a little more refreshing there, so. Okay. Don't forget our Fiesta <laughs> Metal giveaway, <laughs> Thursday, April 20th. That there. is today, and that's where Jen <laughs> yes. is right now at AFFCU. Hey, Jen. That's right. You know what I'm thinking? A mangonada margarita topped like a michelada. There you go, right? That'll cool you off. Again, our giveaway starts here in a few minutes, really, and we're at AFFCU on 1604. And, Bron, Jessica, you're fourth in line. Yes. Why do you love collecting medals? I love the vintage ones. I love the historical. And I meet all these friends, yes. new friends, and we all party. Yes. We love it. Yes, that's what we love to do in San Antonio, yes, right? that's right. We party. <laughs> party with the purpose. That's pa why. Party with the purpose. And look at those gorgeous earrings. All right, 2 p.m. is when it starts. Fiona Mike, okay, back to you. Thank you. Woo! Love the crowd out there. Hey, don't forget, Fiesta officially begins tonight with Fiesta Fiesta, and we are going to be there on stage starting at about uh, 5 o'clock this evening. All the festivities out there, they're going to do the cutting of the neckties and the breaking of the Cascaronas yes, and the all the Fiesta there. royalty. Yeah. We've got all our selfies. Yes, indeed. Because I know a, you're all about those. We do a selfie with Instagram. the crowd. It's always great because the crowd <laughs> out there is absolutely fantastic. Don't forget, it is down there at uh, Travis Park this year. Yes. Yes, because of all the other construction. So, a little little more quaint mm -hmm. yeah mm -hmm. and uh, don't forget and, you know um, in you know the tradition of celebrating yes today uh, we are also celebrating Happy a co-worker's fabulous oh. birthday to it's Tony we are fabulous director happy birthday Tony a and friend of all <laughs> and animals you know when he sees this he know he'll know who's behind okay. what's behind the Photoshop yeah.